that I was trying to make as far as the health implications of engaging in anal sex. My point was basically that because the act in itself is much more likely, I mean, uh, increasing the risk of uh, rectal prolapse, so, viral hepatitis B and C, syphilis, okay. chlamydia. So, so I know that you're against, like you're for like a porn ban. Are you also for like a cigarettes, alcohol ban and stuff like that? Uh, I wouldn't say a ban. You no. might have to give Jake the last word here coming up just because I, you had uh, kind of made that case there, John, on the health concerns that you had. And yeah. just to go well, to Q&A I just want to know how that extrapolates. Like, do you find other things that are health concerns to that need to be we – should, we should, as a society, be like, don't do that. It's bad. You should be ashamed for doing that? Uh, I think that the society should have a standard of what is good derived from what helps people flourish. And I don't think that cigarette smoking, alcohol consumption, or sodomy are within that framework. So do you think that, do you think that cigarettes or gay butt sex kill more people? Pick one and then we can go to Cuba. You'd be surprised. You would actually be surprised. It's, I kid you not. I kid it's you not. Cigarettes, not gay sex chat. I, I kid you not. Per capita. It's per capita. It's cigarettes. It's, it's literally not. It is. More people die from cigarettes than die from fucking their asses. I was talking about per capita. Pretty sure I have per capita. Bruh. We let's see. This